hi everyone welcome to SI share classes today in this video we have to find the value of root 7 up to six decimal places in easy way so please watch the video till the end so let's start the video so first of all write here the number 7 here now we can take here a point beside 7 now for up to 6 decimal place we have to first write here 12 number of 0 so first taking here 12 0 and making them as a pair so taking 2 0 as a pair so here we get 6 pair of 0 now drawing the division line on both side next we have to take here a number here and multiplying by that number which is less than and almost near 7 so first taking here 1 and multiplying by 1 so this is less than 1 but not almost near 7 now taking here 2 and multiplying by 2 this is less than and almost near 7 now if you take here 3 and multiplying by 3 this is 9 which is greater than 7 so in this case we have to take 2 because 4 almost near and less than 7 so we should take this so taking here 2 and 2 to 0 4 now subtracting this so from 7 this is obviously 3 now this point will be here and now write down here the first pair of zero by this way and now drawing here a division line okay now talking here and important things here so here the number is two so we have to add by the same number two so two plus two equals to four now we have to choose a number beside 4 and multiplying by that number which is less than and almost near 300. So first taking here 1 and multiplying by 1 which is less than 300 but not almost near 300. So now taking here 2 and multiplying by 2, 4, 8 which is less than but not almost 300. Now if we take here 3 and multiplying by 3, 9 12 which is less than 300 but not almost 300 now if you take here 4 and multiplying by 4 16 17 which is less than but not almost near now if you take here 5 and multiplying by 5 25 20 22 which is less than but not almost near 300 next if you take here 6 and multiplying by 6 so 36 carry 3 24 27 which is almost near and less than 300 last if you take here 7 and multiplying by 7 so 7 7 is 49 carry 4 28 32 which is greater than 300 so in this case we have to take 6 because 276 is almost near and less than 300 so we should write here 6 and right here 276 now subtracting this so from 10 this is 4 and here 2 now similarly we have to write here next pair of 0 and drawing here a division line now talking here an important things is here the last number is 6 so we have to add by the same number 6 so 6 plus 6 12 carry 1 this is 5 now similarly we have to choose a number beside this and multiplying by that number so you have to check by taking 1 2 3 4 at your home now i am going to take here directly 4 first and multiplying by 4 so 16 9 so which is less than 2400 now if you take here 5 and 
multiplying by 5 so 5 5 0 25 carry 2 10 22 25 plus 1 26 which is greater than 2400 so in this case we have to take 2096 which is less than and almost near 2400 so we should take this and right here 4 so right here 2096 now subtracting this so from 10 this is 4 here 0 and here 3 now similarly we have to write first the next pair of 0 here and drawing here a division line and similar process we have to write here 4 so adding by 4 so 4 plus 4 8 2 5 and we have to choose a number beside this so you have to take a number up to 1 2 3 4 at home now i'm going to take here directly 5 and multiplying by 5 so 25 80 40 42 this is 14 and this is 26 which is less than 30400 0, 0, 0. now if you take here 6 and multiplying by 6 so 6 6 are 36 carry 3 51 and this is 17 and this is 31 which is greater than 30400 0, 0. so in this case we have to take this because this is almost near and less than 30400 0, 0. so we should take here 5 and right here 26425 now subtracting this so from 10 this is 5 and here 7 and here obviously will be 9 and here 3 now similarly we have to first write here the next pair of 0 first and drawing here a division line now here the last digit is 5 so we have to add by the number 5 so 5 plus 5 is 10 carry 1 9 and here 2 5 now similarly we have to take here a number and multiplying by that number so you have to take 1 2 3 4 5 6 at home now I am going to take here directly 7 and multiplying by 7 okay so seven seven zero forty nine carry four zero four nine seven zero sixty three carry six twenty thirty five plus two thirty seven which is less than three nine seven five zero zero now if you take here eight and multiplying by eight then eight eight zero sixty four carry six so six 72 carry 7 23 and this is 42 which is greater than 397500 so in this case we have to take this and this is almost near and less than this so we should take this so taking here 7 and right here 3705 now subtracting this so from 10 this is 1 here 5 here 1 and here 7 and here will be 2 okay similarly we have to write here the next pair of 0 first okay so write down here 0 and drawing here a division line so here the last digit is 7 so we have to add by 7 so 7 plus 7 14 carry 1 1 okay now we have to take a number beside this and multiplying by that number so you have to check by taking 1 2 3 at home now i am going to take here directly 4 sorry 5 and multiplying by 5 so 5 5 0 25 carry 2 
twenty twenty two carry two so seven forty five carry four five two is a ten fourteen and five five is twenty five twenty six which is less than twenty seven one five one zero zero now if we take here six and multiplying by six then six six are thirty six carry three twenty four plus three twenty seven carry two six eight plus two eight six nine zero fifty four carry five twelve seventeen and this is thirty thirty one which is greater than two seven one five one zero zero so in this case we have to take this this is almost near and less than this so we should take this so taking here five and write down here two six four five seven two five okay now subtracting this so from ten this is five and here will be seven and here three and here obviously nine and here six okay now last we have to write here last pair of zero first so first write down here the pair of zero and similarly drawing here a division line and here the last digit is five so we have to add by five so five plus five ten carry one this is five and write down the other number here and similarly we have to choose here a number and multiplying by that number so you have to take here uh, first taking here one and multiplying by that number so taking here first one and multiplying by one so the same number if we multiplying by one which is less than six nine three seven five zero zero now if you take here two and multiplying by two so this is two two zero four two zero ten three eighteen carry one so five and this is ten which is greater than six nine three seven five zero zero so in this case we have to take this and this is almost near six nine three seven five zero zero so we should take this so write down here one and write down here five two nine one five zero one now subtracting this so from ten nine here nine and here nine also and here five and here four and here six and this is one so and continuous so therefore we have to find the value of root seven up to six decimals so root six root seven equals to two point six four five seven five one so that's all thanks for watching if this video is helpful to you then please share it with your friend thanks for watching